So a few days ago we got to see the first look at the Galaxy Watch 4 which showed that it has no rotating bezel and that it's a cross between the Galaxy Watch series and Active series. And it also led many to believe that there might not be a separate Active model at all. Samsung is merging the two lineups. Turns out that's not the case. The beloved rotating bezel lives on as we have the first official look at the Galaxy Watch 4 Classics, that's right. They have renamed it to Classic which makes sense as it looks like conventional Classic watches. And by the way, Classic branding isn't something new because we have seen them using it in their previous Galaxy Smart Watches. With that said, the watch doesn't look any different than the Galaxy Watch 3 except for little changes to the strap design and different color options. If you are new here then subscribe to this channel for the latest updates of watches and smart watches, like this video, and leave a comment if you have a question or suggestion. To be honest, the design has been similar since the Galaxy Gear S3 in 2016. Aside from the active series, Samsung hasn't really touched the design for 5 years. It would have been appreciated if they have reduced the bezels to make it seem more like it belongs in 2021. Anyway. Samsung will offer the Classic in three sizes while the regular watch will be offered in two. Both watches will have a bias sensor that measures your body composition to tell you how fat you are. They will also come with One UI Watch, the new custom skin for Samsung smart watches with Google's new Wear OS. The new OS will help Galaxy users to use millions of compatible Play Store apps. Also, a lot of you were asking about the current Galaxy watches getting the Wear OS through a firmware update. Well, even though Samsung hasn't said anything about it but it seems that may not happen. Because Samsung during the Mobile World Congress event said that they will provide up to three years of software updates to Tizen-based smartwatches. This includes everything from your Galaxy Watch Active to the Galaxy Watch 3. This basically confirms that the current Galaxy Watches will not be able to run the new Wear OS which is a bummer especially to the Galaxy Watch 3 users because their smartwatch is basically outdated less than a year since it was released. Now, whether this is a hardware limitation or Samsung just wants you to buy the new watch for? We'll never know as I don't think Samsung will ever talk about this. In any case, Samsung will unveil the watch 4 in Classic alongside the Z Fold 3 in August. This is all for now, like this video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next video, until then goodbye.